and one phase of Syria's brutal civil war draws to a close. For weeks, the Syrian regime's army has blasted into the rebel-held parts of Aleppo, once Syria's largest city. Day after day, forces loyal to President Bashar al-Assad have fought to regain control. Neighborhood after neighborhood has fallen from rebel hands. As the Syrian army goes from street to street, it meets resistance. One by one, houses are checked and cleared. The Russian Defense Ministry says that 100,000 civilians have fled what was rebel-controlled Aleppo. There is little left to stay for. In the north of the city, some version of a school day. Aleppo has been fought over for four long years, as long as some of these children can remember. There are physical injuries here and deep mental wounds too. Some of the children were born two or three years ago, five years ago. Only what they know is the bombardment, is the war. They even don't react when the explosion happens. They, they lose their own resilience. So they are much more vulnerable to, to any harm, to any attack, because for them, war is normal. The last rebel neighborhoods are now being fought over. The battle is drawing to a close. The prize may be ruins, but the Syrian government has some sort of victory within its sights. Johnny Diamond, BBC News.